Good job. Good job, Ms. Vera. All right, ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome. Happy Monday, happy new way of learning. Um, I'm so excited to see so many of you today. So this is really cool. Um, I just want to say um, I've missed you guys so much. It's, uh, it's really, it's been rough for me. And uh, I just, I hope that you guys are well and your families are well. And um, I really miss being in the classroom with you guys. So we're going to try the next best thing, which is communicating this way. Um, it's better than nothing. And uh, I'm really excited to, uh, to do this with you guys. So anyways, uh, we're going to go ahead and um, get started with just rules, procedures, and everything. Can you guys hear me? Yeah. Okay, cool. Thumbs up if you can. Um, someone just said they lost my video. Anyways, we're going to get started with the rules and procedures of Zoom and all your expectations. Um, right now, you guys should all be muted and nobody's video should be showing, so make sure you guys hide that um, if possible. So I'm going to go ahead and take you to our little PowerPoint. Um, today, our objective is to just kind of make sure that we understand Zoom and all the procedures and stuff that go with that. So you'll get acquainted with this amazing tool that we're gonna be using. Um, if you guys have a notebook close by, if you wanna take notes, you, if you have your ancient history, some people grabbed that that last week. Um, if you have it, you can jot down some things, but you really don't have to only if you want to like kind of learn the app a little bit. And then if you guys have questions about your Shark Tank business plans, you can have those too. We're gonna to be going over those the last few minutes today of our lesson. So today's agenda, obviously I'm gonna go over our live classroom rules. And then administration at LG also came up with their own rules. So I'll uh, go through those. Also, rewards that you guys can earn by being in this live classroom. I know it's going to be a learning experience for everybody, but if you have good attendance, good behavior during these videos, um, you guys get rewards. So I'm going to show you those. We're going to talk about how we can get into little group discussions, breakout sessions, if you will. So like in the classroom, when I say, okay, group one, group two, you can actually do that through Zoom. So we'll do a little practice round today. Uh, some how-tos for navigating Zoom. There's a chat, there's reactions, and then at the end, we'll do our Shark Tank business plan. So that's kind of what we're going to go through here in the next 25 to 30 minutes. And then the last five minutes we'll give you guys for questions and chatting and things like that. So thanks for bearing with me and uh, let's have a great day today. So here are some Zoom class rules that I thought were really great. Um, we found these online so you might have a lot of your teachers use the same one. So it's good because we'll be all on the same page. So just make sure that you guys show up at the scheduled time. Uh, my classes are gonna be this week, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at nine. So thank you to those of you guys who were here on time. Um, that really is important so we can start right away. Please find a quiet place free from anything that might distract you. No TV, no siblings, um, pets, uh, things like that. The things are gonna distract you because we are learning. This is like, we're gonna be learning material. So we want you to be able to focus like you would in the classroom. Uh, maintain respect both in speaking, writing, and appearance. Um, thank you for doing that. Uh, even though sometimes we have your video muted, there are some rewards that you can have your video on. So you wanna look decent. Uh, please stay on mute the entire time during a lesson unless I unmute you. Uh, you have little cool raise hand buttons and things like that. If you want to contribute, you have thumbs up and applause. So you guys can use those when appropriate. My video needs to remain on so that you guys can see me. Uh, we need to promote eye contact, just like in the LG 53. And then try not to eat, chew gum, drink in front of the camera. Um, it still kind of is a classroom setting. So yeah, we want to make sure we keep that, keep that good. So just a couple of rules for you during this time. 
And then here's some administration rules. So as far as like not you being able to use your profile picture. Now that could be a reward. So if you do well or you show up to five classes in a row, I might be like, hey, you know what, Emma Hansen, you can have your profile picture up today. Or Gage, you can have your profile picture up because you did a really great job today. So just keep that in mind. Um, your profile must have your official name or like your parents' name so we can see your last name. No um, nicknames or things like that. So make sure you can go into your settings and kind of topple that today and make sure you have your profile or your last name is fine. Um, you must use appropriate language when I do unmute you during opportunities for that. Um, you're not permitted to spam the chat and then you're not permitted to draw, write, or access any inappropriate material. So please make sure you're staying on board. You guys are really good at that. So thank you for keeping up with that. And then of course, any of these that are broken have to go through administration. So yeah, just have to say that. All right, so good behavior in our Zoom lessons. I like this one, this is fun. Um, if you guys come, if you work hard, if you ask questions, if you attend, several sessions in a row. Um, I will allow you to show your video. I will allow you to kind of like take the floor and speak, be unmuted for a certain time. Sometimes I might even make you the host. So you get to kind of run the show. Um, you get to choose the song that opens up class each day. And also this is fun. You get to show a tour of your favorite room in the house if you are on good behavior. Obviously, dojo points are a thing. You get to shout out your friends that are a part of the chat. You get a shout out from me on my Instagram. And then any kind of show and tell opportunities, like, look, this is my animal. Come say hi. So a lot of these things, we want to definitely give you privileges too. So uh, yeah. So what I'm going to do, we're going to practice something and I'm bear with me because this is my first Zoom lesson. Um, we are going to do a breakout session. So what that means is you're going to go into little separate chat rooms with certain classmates and you guys are going to talk about um, the goals and expectations you have for yourself during this time. So I'm going to unmute you guys. And then you're going to get like a little notification and it's going to say like, go to this other room. So accept that. And I'm going to give you guys a few minutes to chat with each other and just kind of say, Hey, and talk about the goals and expectations that you want to set for yourself for these types of lessons from now on. So, um, here we go. Back. Oh. Ask them how we get back. What are we supposed to do? Hey guys, you're just going to be talking about your goals and expectations during this learning time on Zoom. Okie dokie. Thank you. Yeah, paying attention to good ones, and I yeah. think uh, like showing up early 
Could mm-hmm. be a good one because you, Cause, like, you don't want to miss something. That. Because like if there's like a test, like for example, if there's like a test on Friday, and then you and you were in there on for a class. Well, maybe she doesn't want you on. That, um, that um, certain like, part of the thing. Whoa! Yeah. What the heck is going on? You're not helpful at all. Oh my gosh! Yeah, she said next. For this person. Okay. Yeah. No room. Everybody okay here? Is everybody okay here? Uh, Hi. Hi. How's everyone doing? Good. Okay. Good. We are able to talk. Okay. okay yeah, you are. So you're supposed to or not. Oh. Matthew, are you can you hear us, Matthew? Yes, I can. Okay. Hello, cool. Matthew. You guys are just chatting about what your expectations for yourself are during this time. Alrighty. Alrighty. Thank you. Yes. Yeah, I think. I was already signed one, but it kind of crashed and I closed out. All right, guys, all the breakout rooms have about one more minute before we come back together. Hi. Hello, everyone. Um, hey. Oh. Hey. Oh. Hey. Oh. Hey. Oh. Hey. 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 Okay, about 15 more seconds for the breakout sessions, everyone. All right, so you guys were talking about some of the things that you were going to do personally for this Zoom live lessons for your own goals. So, um, let Aiden Brown, I'm going to call on you. What was one of the things that you wanted to do during this time personally? Um, to try to be punctual to all of the video chats. Yeah, that's definitely something that is important because you don't want to miss anything like super important. Um, you definitely want to be here for that. So thank you so much, Aiden. Um, is there anybody that you want to shout out right now for that answer? Um, let's see what Brady has to say. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, um, well, I kind of thought the same thing, but um, to also be on time for all, for all the meeting and maybe be like four or five minutes early. <clears throat> yeah, being early is definitely super, super important for the sessions. Thank you so much, Brady, for that. Um, I'm gonna allow you to give a shout out to someone too. Who do you want to shout out that's attending this class today? Um, how about Andreas? Andreas, okay. Okay. What's up, well, Andreas? I, how you doing? Good. I think that it might make it so like we can understand it better because like you can help us more. Yeah, definitely. Thank you so much. How are you, Andreas? Good. That's good. We miss you. <laughs> so I'm going to continue with our chat. So goals and expectations for yourself. You guys definitely said that you wanted to be on time. Some people even said that you wanted to be early for the sessions. 
Some people say the sessions are just going to help them learn the, the goals and objectives. So to be here in, a, in attendance is super, super important. So thank you guys for sharing that. That was really, really awesome. And if you haven't or it was tough for you, I encourage you to come up with some goals and kind of put them by your learning space, even if it is your word that we came up with at the beginning of the year. Um, I know my word has definitely helped me during this time. Um, I've had to just stop and breathe so much this during this craziness. So I hope your word is helping you. Maybe you want to put that up too. You definitely want to have like your learning space to be your space during this time. So thank you guys for sharing those. Um, ways to participate in your chat session. So there are really cool things when we actually get to the content. So Next time we meet on Wednesday, we are going to start the geography of ancient Greece. Yay. So when we do get to the content, there are ways for you to react. There are ways for you to say, Ooh, I'm getting this, or I have a question. Um, those are with the reactions. So if you guys want to take a look, some are at the bottom of your little window. Some are at the side, but you can give a thumbs up. You can give applause. And I want you guys to only use these when appropriate. So if you guys want to start practicing those reactions, anybody want to throw up a thumbs up or throw up a applause, just so you so I see that you're finding these. Nice. Yes. Excellent job, you guys. Very, very good. And if not, you totally will get the hang of it. Um, it's, it's something that, you know, us teachers had to get the hang of too. So thank you guys for throwing up those, those symbols there. Excellent. Excellent job. Perfect. And then also we have chats on the side too. So if there's any questions that you want to ask me during the lesson, if there's something happening with the video, I've already seen that some of us have, have posted about the video and it cut out. So yeah, so thank you for that. And then at the end of the lesson, I can go back or, you know, during the lesson, if I'm not like super teaching, I can go back and address those questions. So anything that you guys might have during the lesson, you can go ahead and chat. Please keep the chats relevant to the topic. Don't say, oh, Miss Kara, like, how was your break? Uh, make sure you talk about the lesson and then you can only chat with me. So you can't be like, you know, what's up, Theo? How's it going? Um, that's not something that happens during this time. So make sure you guys, you know, go by the rules when it comes to the chats and the reactions because they are a really great tool that we wanna use appropriately. Moving on uh, to participation, um, you guys got to experience a breakout session today. So that was pretty cool. Um, I really enjoy having you guys being able to chat with each other. Um, just know that you guys will receive a notification that you're entering into a session like this. You all did a wonderful job. Um, I will be able to come into the groups and you guys probably saw me enter in to a couple of the groups and uh, I heard some really great conversation and thank you for that. I will give you a time limit. So a lot of you guys said like you have one more minute. Um, so keep that in mind. And then I will call on students like we did to kind of share out what was spoken about. So thank you to those students who spoke today, Brady, Andreas, and Aiden. We really appreciate that. All right, guys. So this is the point where um, I wanted to take these last 10 minutes of our lesson today to kind of um, talk about our Silk Road because our business plans are due tomorrow. And uh, just remember, I prefer it to be typed. Um, writing the answers in and taking photos of what you wrote is is really fine. That's totally fine, too. Um, you can email me at my learning gate email or upload it as an Edsby message. Um, so right now what I'm going to do is I'm going to have you guys use the raise hand function, if you can find it, to ask questions. And then I will unmute you so you can ask that because another student might have the same question. So. Is there anybody out there, Theo? What's up, Theo? Will we have any time tomorrow to work on it? Yes, that's a really great question, Theo. Thank you so much for asking that. Um, yes, the projects are due at midnight. So the reason I'm saying that, I don't want you working 
until midnight. That's the thing. But you have the whole day tomorrow to do your project. Does that make sense, Theo? Yes. Perfect. Who else has a question? I'm scanning. Thank you, Nick. I see your thumbs up. Good job, bud. Well, I don't see any questions, but if anything comes up, just we're going to be here for the next few moments. Um, I do want to shout out, is Colby with us today? Colby, where's Colby here? He sent his extra credit for his Shark Tank. Um, he sent a photo of himself doing a pitch. It was really awesome. And it was a really good photo. So I'm going to share that. And then um, is Antoine in the house today? Antoine, he also sent his pitch 60 second video as well. So it was really, really good. And uh, so wanted to encourage you guys to do the extra credit opportunities. If you didn't see them, I made a video uh, about that. Um, what's up, Anthony? I see that you have a question. What's going on? Well, is the whole business plan also include your pitch? Yes, your written down pitch. So okay. you don't have to do a video. That's just extra credit. But yes, your business plan should include a 60 second pitch. Now at the bottom, you see where I get you guys started in the pitch. Like, hello, my name is. But remember, after that is the actual pitch. Like, hey, sharks, have you ever experienced this before in the Silk Road? Well, boy, do I have the product for you. Here, you should do this, this, and this. So that's kind of important to make sure you write that out. Does that make sense, Anthony? Yeah, thanks. Awesome. You're welcome. Let's see. Anybody else have their hands up? All right, I see you, Luke. Okay, do we still have time to put out our extra credit? Yeah, absolutely. Your extra credit, again, it's all due tomorrow. Like, you have the whole day to, to do that. And guys, honestly, I'm super flexible. If you guys want to turn in your extra credit Wednesday, too, I'm totally fine. I just don't want you to get jumbled up with um, the new lesson that we're starting on Wednesday because we're doing the geography of Greece. But if you think you can handle it all and you want to do that, that would be perfect. So okay, you can turn your Thank extra you. credit in Wednesday too. That's, I'm, that's totally fine. Sound good? Okay. Yes. Okay, perfect. Hey, Sienna. How's it going? Hi. What's your question, sweetheart? Um, do we have sharks this this time or no, since we're home? Yeah, so did you see my video about that? I think. Maybe. <laughs> maybe <laughs> so not. I did a I, I did a video called Frequently Asked Questions and uh it addressed like, hey guys, no partners for this project and unfortunately no sharks, but I'm your big shark, so I'll be making the deals. So yeah. So no sharks, unfortunately. No, I didn't think I see that. You should. You should go to my YouTube channel and watch all of my amazing videos. <laughs> you should subscribe. I've never thought I would say that ever, you guys. Go subscribe to my YouTube channel. Like this is the time okay. to ring right now. The best I will. history teacher. <laughs> <laughs> um, so guys, <clears throat> excuse me. Oh, hey, Nick. What's happening, brother? Hi, um, so for the extra credit videos, do we have to make the product too like we did last time? So that's one of the options. You don't mm -hmm. have to. Um, all of the options for extra credit is you can make a 60 second pitch. You can take a photo of yourself like in motion or you can make the product. It's, and you can do any one of those. Cool. Yeah. Yeah, Miss Kara, in my opinion, I think making a motion photo is a lot easier because, yeah, I'm, I'm still trying to figure out my pitch. And if I have a little more time to figure it out, 
I'll have it done by then. Yeah, totally. Hey, Jake, what's happening? Well, hello. Hello. What's your question? Uh, it, can it be a business as well? Like yes, that's a fantastic question. So you can do a product or you can do a business that, that does anything or addresses anything uh, during the Silk Road. So yes. Does, okay, another big question my mom has for me is, does it have to be from that time era? It does. Yeah, since we're learning about the ancient times, mm -hmm. the invention or business does have to work for the times. Yes. Good job. So, can we can we use parts of it that are not from time from that time? A uh, question. Another big. Yeah. I know. Uh, does it have to be all from that time? The can uh, use a frying pan. Or it's basically like kind of like knowing what we know today, with everything that we've learned, and using that knowledge for the ancient time. So, as far as like computers and internet, like that wouldn't work. No, but no, no. Like, like if we lessons. know. If we know like Uber, we can do like an Uber of the ancient times, or we could do like DoorDash of the ancient times. What about for money? Like, oh, just put everything in dollars so it all makes sense okay. for everyone. Oh, okay. Miss Kara. Thank you. You are so welcome. Miss Kara. Yes. Um, I was wondering, like, for, like, your um, business, can you draw out your, um, like, what it looks like? Yeah. Yeah, okay. please do. Please because do that. I was thinking for, like, um, what is it called? Since I'm, like, done with my pitch and stuff, mm -hmm. I was going to draw a picture to describe, like, what it looks like. And, like, you know, like how yeah. it, everything. You and, should do that. And how do I, like, so can I, how, do you want it like scanned or do you just want a picture of it for me to send it to you? I prefer it to be typed and sent as a document, but uh -huh. if you have to do the picture thing, if you, you can't figure it out, that's totally fine. Okay. Thank okay. You. So, hey guys, we are approaching our last couple of minutes. I am going to unmute everybody in just a second, but I'm also going to allow certain kids to do shout outs. Um, because you guys all like just did a really good job today and I'm just excited to just see your your names and the people that are here It just it warms my heart because I miss you guys so much So I'm gonna unmute everyone and I'm gonna um, do a random dojo point and if I call your name and you're here um, Shout out one of your friends say like hey, what's up miles? How you doing? Like I just want to shout out my friend miles right now. Just hey, so um, I'm gonna give you guys that opportunity, okay? So the first ahead, dojo point, the first dojo know, point goes okay. to, is Dawson in attendance today? No. <laughs> no? Yeah. You did. I thought he was. Dawson is here. I'm here. Dawson, who do you wanna shout out today? Hi, Theo. <laughs> Hope you're having a great day. Aw, thanks. That's so awesome. Oh, that's so nice. <laughs> is Andreas, obviously he was here. Is Andreas still here? Uh, yeah. Andreas, he's who here. do you want to shout out? Yeah, he's here. Oh, what's up, Brady? <laughs> hey. Awesome. Thanks, Andreas. Hey. Can I ask a question? Yeah, of course. Um, how do I, how do I raise my hand? Is so this Miles? Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, no that's a great people. question. So if you go oh, to the, the, um... Why is it Evan's post? Okay. <laughs> like, what is going on? Gosh. Gosh. All right, guys, I have to mute you if you're going to talk out. Thank you. So if you go over to your, like, if you go over to your chat area, you'll be able to see where you can raise your hand. Student participants. Kara. Is Amina here? Oh, I see it. No, she's not. No, no she's okay. Not. How do you see Is Kelsey here? I only see four people. Honey? 
26 participants. Oh. Are there only six participants? It's like 15. All right. Hey, guys. So I had to mute everybody. It was just too crazy. Um, anyways, I hope you have a great day. Um, I have one more hour after this set aside for ancient history work. So from 10 to 11, obviously, our um, Zoom session is only going to be a certain amount of time. So I have set aside our time to work on your ancient history business plans. So you guys are going to go ahead and do that until it is time for math, which you'll have starting at 11 for that Zoom session. Um, I am going to just do one more scan if there's any hands or any questions. So thank you for that. Yes. Um, hello, uh, Ms. Gara. Hello, is this Maddox? Yes, this is hey, Maddox. Hey Maddox, how are you? I'm doing good. Good. What's your question? Um, so you said how for one of the extra credit options, we had to draw a picture of basically our product. Yeah. Um, if you're doing multiple products, do you draw a picture of all of them or just one of them? I mean, you can, whatever you want to do, if it is better explained by drawing all of them, you can, but if just drawing one kind of shows me your, your business or your product, that's totally fine. All right, thank you, Ms. Yeah, Kara. of course. Ms. Kara, about the invention price, starting the invention or business price-wise. Is this I'm Andrew? Yes. Okay, Andrew, if you have a question, I want you to raise your hand, okay? Because you can't just unmute yourself. Okay, okay, but I can't. All right, so Andrew, what's your question? Uh, starting, the, how much would it cost to start the invention or idea? I know you said like less than like 500,000, but. Yeah, it's totally up to you how much okay. it costs and how much money that you're asking for. Okay. Um, it, it's, it's something that you make up, honestly. Oh, okay. okay? I'm not, I'm not going to chart. I'm not, I'm not asking for a five hundred thousand dollars to start my invention or okay idea. yeah no, no it's whatever you want yeah because okay. I figured it's too expensive anyway <laughs> so. all right and Miss Emma Hansen um hi so I was thinking for my uh since I already have like my product drawn out um uh, how do I uh like get the extra credit for that how so would you'll I just that? take a photo and uh -huh. send it over to me Oh, like on Edsby? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Thank you. You got it. What's up, Luke? Okay. Um, what if the product that you're using would work back then, but then it was made, like, now? Can you give me an example so I can follow you? Like, cleats. Because okay. you know how there was that mountain they walked on, the Trail of Bones? Yeah. I thought of shoe spikes. Yeah, that's a good to idea. Keep, keep their that's, grip. Totally, that's totally fine. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, good job. What's up, Jack Grant? What you got for us today? Hello. I Hello. Was the same thing as Luke. Uh-huh. Uh, like, I, I came up with, like, a silk mate. is like, an easy, like, an automated way to move woven however you say it so mm -hmm. easier cool it's like machine but i don't know if that would work back then i think so they had some pretty up-to-date technology with their weaving so yes. i think you could work that out yeah. let's go <laughs> all right guys i am going to do one last dojo point and this dojo point Whoever wins this gets to choose the song that we open up with on Wednesday. All right, so here we go. Take a look at Dojo. And if this person is here, you get to pick the song. So, is Emma Jones here today? Hi. Hi. So, what song do you want to hear Wednesday? Uh, I don't know. Um, you could even pick a genre if you want. 
Maybe hip hop. Hip hop? All right. I definitely got you at that one. Thank awesome. You. Well, guys, if you have any questions, I'm going to um, move on to Edsby and Google Classroom. I'm going to close the Zoom chat, but I'm going to review the questions before. And if I feel like I have to make another video or do something to address your questions, I will. But for now, go ahead, work on your Silk Road business plans. Any questions, just like I said, I'm going to be glued to Edsby today and Google Classroom. So you'll definitely be able to get an answer from me. So I hope you had a good experience. This is my first time. So I hope you guys learned a little something. And if you have any feedback, I'd be glad to hear it. But again, I miss you guys. And I hope you have a good rest of your day. All right. Bye, guys. Have a good day. Bye. 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 Bye.